In this video we will learn what is marine insurance and its types. Marine insurance is a form of insurance that provides protection for ships, boats, and marine cargo from physical loss or damage from perils such as fire, collision, piracy, and natural disasters. Marine insurance is also referred to as marine cargo insurance, boat insurance, or marine hull insurance. Marine insurance is designed to protect against losses that may occur while a ship is in transit or while the cargo is being loaded or unloaded. Marine insurance policies are typically written in the form of a contract and cover a wide range of different risks, including physical losses of the ship or its cargo, financial losses due to delays in transit, and legal liabilities. Marine insurance is important for any business that ships goods, as it provides protection against losses that could occur due to a variety of risks. Marine insurance protects against losses resulting from natural disasters, such as storms, hurricanes, floods, and earthquakes, as well as man-made risks such as theft, piracy, and war. In addition, marine insurance can provide protection against financial losses due to delays in transit, or due to damage or loss of the ship or its cargo. In order to obtain marine insurance, businesses must provide the insurance company with information about the type of cargo being shipped, the value of the cargo, the route of the ship, and the value of the ship itself. The insurance company will then assess the risk of the voyage and determine the amount of coverage that is required in order to provide adequate protection. The cost of marine insurance is typically calculated as a percentage of the total value of the cargo and the ship, and is based on the risk associated with the voyage. The higher the risk, the higher the premium. Premiums can also be influenced by the type of cargo being shipped and the route of the voyage. Marine insurance is an important protection for any business that ships goods and can provide peace of mind and financial security in the event of an unforeseen loss. It is important for businesses to understand the risks associated with their voyage and to select the right coverage for their needs. With the right marine insurance policy, businesses can protect their investments and ensure their safe passage. Marine insurance is a form of insurance that provides coverage for the loss or damage of goods, vessels, and cargo that are transported by sea. It is an important type of insurance for anyone transporting goods, whether for commercial or personal purposes, as it can help to cover the cost of any losses that may occur during the journey. In this video, we will take a look at the different types of marine insurance and how they can be beneficial for your business. Types of Marine Insurance The first type of marine insurance is hull insurance. Hull insurance covers the physical damage to a vessel, including any damage caused by storms or accidents. This type of insurance is important for those who are transporting goods, as it can help to cover the cost of any repairs that need to be made. It is also important for those who use their vessel for recreational purposes, as it can help to protect them from any financial losses they may incur due to an accident or natural disaster. The second type of marine insurance is cargo insurance. This type of insurance covers the physical loss or damage to goods that are being transported by sea. It is important for anyone who is transporting goods, as it can help to cover the cost of any losses that occur during the journey. This type of insurance is especially important for those who are engaged in international trade, as any losses that occur due to accidents or natural disasters can be extremely costly. The third type of marine insurance is liability insurance. This type of insurance covers any losses that occur due to the negligence or fault of the insured. It is important for anyone who is transporting goods, as it can help to cover the cost of any losses that may occur due to an accident. It is also important for those who use their vessel for recreational purposes, as it can help to protect them from any financial losses they may incur due to an accident or natural disaster. The fourth type of marine insurance is Protection and Indemnity P&I, insurance. This type of insurance covers any losses that occur due to the negligence or fault of the insured as well as any damages that may occur to third parties. It is important for anyone who is transporting goods, as it can help to cover the cost of any losses that may occur due to an accident. It is also important for those who use their vessel for recreational purposes, as it can help to protect them from any financial losses they may incur due to an accident or natural disaster. The fifth type of marine insurance is hull and machinery H &M, insurance. This type of insurance covers the physical damage to a vessel, as well as any damages that may occur to the machinery or equipment on board the vessel. It is important for anyone who is transporting goods, as it can help to cover the cost of any repairs that need to be made. It is also important for those who use their vessel for recreational purposes, 
as it can help to protect them from any financial losses they may incur due to an accident or natural disaster. The sixth type of marine insurance is war risk insurance. This type of insurance covers any losses that occur due to war or civil unrest. It is important for anyone who is transporting goods, as it can help to cover the cost of any losses that may occur due to war or civil unrest. It is also important for those who use their vessel for recreational purposes, as it can help to protect them from any financial losses they may incur due to war or civil unrest. These are the six main types of marine insurance that are available. It is important to understand the different types of marine insurance and how they can be beneficial for your business. It is also important to shop around for the best rates and coverage for your specific needs. If you need further assistance, it is always best to speak to a qualified insurance broker who can provide you with the best advice and guidance.